We are back for another Attack on Titan reaction. I'm Noah. I'm Devin. And today we're going to be reacting to episode 21 of season 4. Last week was mind blowing. Honestly, I wasn't really processing what was happening. The fact that future Aaron was talking to the past dad and was being seen by even future Aaron? Yeah. <laughs> I don't even that know. That is weird. Well, I guess that's part of his Titan's ability. Yeah, which is cool to see because we've that's... seen some weird abilities by the other Titans. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm like some founder stuff, man. I don't, I don't know, man. So we know that's the attack Titan ability because that's what the yeah. dad had even said it too. The founding Titan, I don't even know what, what the max abilities of that's going to be. And even the cart Titan, it would be so cool to see what that ability is because least favorite is the cart Titan. Yeah. Okay, that didn't help. And then Annie's got abilities. Will this, will something that's going on between Zeke and Aaron wake up the rest of the Titans or something? Yeah. And then we still have Falco. We still got Falco. <laughs> and then I don't know what's going to happen with Gabby. She won't miss whatever she takes a yes. shot. She ain't going to miss at it. That's for sure. She's <laughs> two for two. <laughs> Gabby, shoot for the moon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kill everybody like yeah. that. Yeah. She, she could live. Wow. I didn't think about that. She could. She's smart enough. She probably could do it. She, she could <laughs> do it. Yeah. Like Gabby, don't miss that subscribe button. Hey. You know, you know all, all you got to do is take a shot and hit the like button for the algorithm. Give us, give us a shot. <laughs> give us a shot. Yeah. And then let's just jump into the reaction because the season's got crazy. Yeah. So I'm assuming this one's going to be even more crazy. Oh, yeah. It can only go up from here. Right? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Hopefully. It better. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, let's get right. it. His dad was a big attack time. Yeah. I forgot about that. Dang. He wasted no time. Oh Ooh. my goodness. Oh, Carla was not safe. Ooh. Say, ooh. <laughs> she said, come back for seconds, man. That's so weird. Directly, yeah. Wait. Oh. Oh, this is reminding me of Luffy at Whole Cake. Oh. Tore off his thumbs? I wonder what happened right there. Interesting. This is what I'm thinking. Maybe his dad certain saw certain parts mm -hmm. of the future, but not the whole. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. So there are certain holes. Because of those holes that he didn't see, maybe Aaron is not going to get everything his way as he thought. <gasps> maybe Zeke will be able to stop him. Because why else would he think that it would be possible, right? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I knew when it, once it came to transcending time, I was going to get a little lost. Yeah. Because like you're saying... Like, I, I just want to know what the dad saw. Yeah. Because if he saw what happened at the beginning of season four, that's one thing. Yeah. If he sees what Aaron's plan is going forward, that's another thing. Mm -hmm. Because then he will be able to stop Ymir or get her to change her ways. And I, and I kind of thought it was a lie that Ymir was going to listen to Zeke. Yeah. I thought it wasn't going to really happen. So he has the ability of the founding. Mm -hmm. from, from you, 2000. Dang. What from I... you, but it doesn't good. Wait a minute. Ugh. You little nasty. Oh. oh, man. Yeah. Wow. I knew that was going to happen. Emotional, damn it. What if she wasn't, though? They just did it because she was a kid. Oh, they're hunting her. I was like, I was like, really? He's gonna reward her? I mean, honestly, better than that than be a slave, man. I, I don't know. Lose, you get a chance. Oh, she, look, she survived. It's like the portal to the underworld or something. Alice in first Wonderland. Of all, that way, yeah. <laughs> it's like, first of all, 
That was in Wonderland. Yeah. Second of all, that would hurt. Uh, Ooh. That's how it all started? That thing? Wait. So there wasn't really... Like a devil that gave him the abilities? It was just some random thing from underground? So even she was a slave of Eldia. Yeah. Can't believe they were alive for this long. And she wasn't royal blood. Yeah. Oh, did her kids all get a Titan ability? Oh. She took it? But if she right became a heart. If she became a Titan, she could do it, right? She could still live. But if forgotten her heart, would she still be dead? It would break. And then she would turn into Titan and it would heal, right? I I'm just thinking. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This guy is nuts. Dang, bro. Wait a minute. So could there have been more than seven then? That have royal blood? Well, that have the Titan abilities? Because, like, it started out as three, and then it I mean, yet more people have it, but... What the heck? It was that book. I mean, who hasn't Aaron convinced to do something? Yeah. <sighs> Touch him to activate it. Oh. Is he getting it? Did he... Wait, did he take the ability? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Oh, boy. It's like Aaron had paused the gameplay and he unpaused yeah. it and saw what he wanted to do. Da, 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 da. That's cheating! That's cheating! Oh, he's taking all the walls. Oh. Dang! Here we go. This is what we uh, this is what we predicted. Bro. It's game time, y'all. Wow. There's only half time. Sheesh. Uh, it looked like he was gonna be Aaron was gonna be the size of Historia's dad when he became a Titan and was dragging himself on the ground. But this is something Oh my bigger. goodness. They finally figured it out. It would be Armin that figures yeah. it out first. I just want to know what his, his true objective is, though. Go put your scarf on. So that means out. that he just—he was just being mean to Mikasa for the sake of completing his plan. Dude, he's crushing the world. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, that's straight up true. Yo! Dang. Wow! Dang! So now he's like unstoppable right now. It but, looks like it. I mean, because now he's freed the, all the Titans from the wall, and now he's that. Dang. How much life does he have left though? Maybe he he's got, coming to the end. Do you think he you think he I don't know. Accidentally had the chemical X that create a parasite and now boom. Titans. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's a bad way to start it. Yeah. With with parasites. And you know what par parasites do? 
negative the abilities. They burn. consume. They devour. Yeah, and it's consuming. And Aaron kind of looked like a parasite when he grew. Yeah, I know. Dude, that thing was huge. It so, was ginormous. What was that? The tallest one we know. Was it the Colossal? Not the Colossal. The Colossal Titan. Yeah. Was it? Yeah, that's, that's the one that... Uh, Armin is. I thought there was one bigger. Not that we knew of. The one that was on the ground? The, you know, like, like, oh, like so a... that was Historia's dad when he put the juice in him. But he was, technically he was just a Titan because he hadn't eaten another Titan. Mm. So he was just purely a Titan. If he would have eaten like, man, Armin, or at that point it was not Reiner, it was the other guy, Berthold. If he would have eaten Berthold, then I mean he would have been, who knows how big he would have been. Yeah. But Aaron got what he wanted. Yep. We have a sad backstory by Ymir. Honestly, I did not know if it, I, I did know not know was. what to expect from her backstory. The fact that she was the way she was when she like in I guess that little period of time. Yeah. Like little afterlife scene with Aaron and, and Zeke, where she was just following orders, that told me, okay, she's kinda just doing what like what she's told. And it makes sense now and I feel like it has something to do with that book too. Because remember the mom was saying Hey, you want to be like this person? Oh. Whoever that person was, she said, you know, this is this is probably what Lady like is being like. And when she was trying to follow that type of mindset, maybe he's like, oh, you need be, being Lady like is obeying orders. And uh. maybe she was listening to the king all those times, and then boom. So this whole thing about listening to the royal blood mm -hmm. is that something that she just believed she had to do? You think so much that it became something that carried on to the rest of the people? Yeah. Because she was literally a slave and serving them. I thought once she got the Titan ability, I was like, oh, she's gonna leave, and she still served them. When she, I mean, she was she could have destroyed their whole country. Oh too. yeah. She wanted to. Yeah. She, she could have destroyed the king. She could have. She could have done what she wanted if yeah. she wanted. To. And her face, though, when Aaron was was crying out from like, "Come on, you you wanted me. You were waiting for someone like me." Yeah. Oh man, yeah. I felt I felt so bad for her. Yeah. Now I've been on Eldia's side this whole time. She I doesn't. I don't even think she's Eldian. I mean, we saw it, it was Eldia versus Marley, but she was the slave mm -hmm. of the Eldian king. So. In a way, I, mean, I guess both countries are right that the other person was evil at a point. But then again, you know, it's yeah. war, it's previous generations and all that stuff. They were saying some of the stuff that Marley had taught, and I guess so that we kind of learned from the Eldian side, was true. Mm -hmm. But it wasn't all true. Because yeah. the whole demon thing yeah. wasn't they true. They didn't get it. So there's some in between. But that, then again, that's kind of like history. If you yeah, think about it. Yeah, that's true. Like, things can get lost. Especially if but. you're like another country, you may have your own version or your own side not necessarily that it's wrong like she was evil to marley yeah but even to eldia she was just a tool mm -hmm. like they she built the roads she did this she was a weapon but she wasn't you know she wasn't the one doing it out of her own will she right. just believed she had to do it my thing is i'm just kind of thinking of this as an, in another angle go ahead why didn't wouldn't she have thought of ending it you know what i'm saying the whole yeah. idea of being a titan in the first place she's just following orders and you know all she's doing is killing people i'm pretty sure she had a conscience of some sort but she felt like this is you know what needs to be done so i gotta do it i wonder if she did and that's why when the spear hit her that's yeah that exactly was, that's what i was thinking yeah i had a feeling maybe she's not dead yeah but then they started because she could have easily turned into back in titan and then that king was disgusting man what in the world would make you think to eat your own Slave. And he's like, yeah, you must. I don't know. I was... And then they found out that it was a spine. See, this is the thing that gets me. The first time the the Titan abilities were split up, it was in two or three kids. Mm -hmm. Now, if that kept happening to the next generation, next generation, did it just max out at the the Titans that we know? Those are the only abilities that could come, or could they have continued to do that? Oh. Because what we've been told, if someone a Titan user dies, that ability is inherited by another Eldian. Mm -hmm. But is that really true? Yeah. Do we know that for a fact? Like, if someone were to take Aaron right now, like Historia, and I hate to say this, but, you know, divide and conquer him. What? And, like, her, like, the, to the kid, and, like, maybe to some other people there, would they all gain a Titan ability too? I mean, seems like logically they would. I mean, they're part of her, so yeah. you, they would bear what she has. Because with Zeke, remember what he's been putting to turn people into Titans. Yeah. His oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. That's right. I was going to say that, too. Okay, yeah, yeah. I, I thought you might be going, and then he didn't know. Well, I was going to yeah. say that after years, but oh, okay. yeah, okay. That, no, that was, that was that's, yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking, because I was thinking, where, does he, where, where is he getting it from? Mm -hmm. Like, where in a... So... 
And, and straight up, I kind of did assume that Ymir was going to be of royal blood, mm -hmm. and she's not. So maybe the true power, the true unlocking ability of the Titan does come from someone who's not full of royal blood. Maybe it can come from someone like Aaron, and that's why he's bigger than the previous founding Titans that we've maybe. seen. And because it's like, in a way, she was restricting. Like, remember, there, there are rules on the royal bloodline. Mm -hmm. We know about that. And maybe this was a restriction she was putting. She was only going to do so much, only mm -hmm. allow so much power to be passed on. Mm -hmm. I was thinking, what if it's like, once you have the power, once your royalty, mm -hmm. like it kind of dilutes oh, a little bit, but down. once you pass it, yeah, water downs. But once you pass it on to someone who's not, mm -hmm. it, it's the same level. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because we haven't seen that transformation from Aaron yet. Not even in his historious time. That's kind of a the thing. Back in her time, she was like, you know, whoa, what is this? Yeah. Now people are like, in his time, what is this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. And I mean, we were kind of right. We predicted that the Titans and the walls were gonna do the. And I, I, we did also predict that they were gonna destroy the thing. Yeah. And that's what he said. I wonder if his friends can convince him not to do that and just destroy Marley. But then again, there's Eldians that live in Marley, but they're also brainwashed. Never, yeah. You just don't know. Or at least taught what the Marleans believe. Mm -hmm. I kind of get it. You don't know, so you might as well just like kind of destroy them all. You know, because it's yeah. like, you don't want this idea of the war between, you know, Marleans and aliens and all that. You don't want that to ever exist again because you, you've, we already see what's happened mm -hmm. throughout history between all that and what's what's become of that. Kind of like Historia or maybe Ymir. Mm -hmm. uh, or I'll say what Aaron told Ymir. It's kind of like what he was saying. Like you can, you can end it. You you have the power. You can you can you can stop it right here. Ah! And like he like you were saying, he like you were waiting for someone like me. Mm. <laughs> Low key, maybe this is what people are actually literally waiting for. Oh, I don't know. See, when their backs up are against the wall and Marleyan was invading, I was like. Listen, you got to be willing to risk it all and you got to be willing to destroy everybody because they're all coming after you. But now that he has the power, I'm like, dang, man, you got to destroy everybody. Yeah. <laughs> but then again, like if you don't finish Who everybody else is gonna off. Well, rise up, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, cuz they'll be like, "Oh, we they'll think, what if we could get this power?" Yeah. I mean, that's what they've been thinking this whole time. Yeah. They've all wanted this founding Titan power and then, I don't even know if they ha knew it it went to this extent though. But then it gets it gets kind of tricky because then how do you know, how do you know for sure that Aaron won't ever flip? You know what I'm saying? That's true. I did. I mean, I'm just saying specifically, I only say that because I heard there's going to be another season about this. Yeah. So yeah. after this finishes, what if we learn that he is like, okay, I've completed my mission. You know, now everybody must listen to me. I'm, I'm going to be in charge. Mm -hmm. And what if people don't like that? You know what I'm saying? Now you have a war within. That's the thing. If we, if I'm thinking the way Aaron has been kind of saying that he's never really changed, mm -hmm. I don't think Aaron would want to be the leader. But then again, Aaron does things that he thinks needs to be done. Yeah. Maybe the whole time. He's he's like, like Astoria, I got this. Like yeah. you just hey, relax, Astoria. Yeah. I'm taking care of a business. I feel like maybe for him it's like, more of like a game of chess. It is. And maybe this is what his dad saw. Mm -hmm. He saw the part where the walls are coming down, the titans are coming out. So we don't actually know, maybe the dad didn't actually know if he completed it. Yeah. Man, do you think he will? I mean, at the I don't know. I'm well, I, I don't, I, I'll, I'll say right now, I don't see how he couldn't yeah. do it, but we'll just have to see. I mean, I don't, I have to assume Zeke is still alive. I don't, I don't know. He probably has something up his sleeve. I don't know. There's still a lot I don't know about the show yet. I mean, we still have to wait on Annie because we know we want to see her. I don't mm -hmm. know. Is that going to come about? You well, know? now with the walls taken care of, what? was Annie underneath the walls? So maybe maybe oh. maybe that's opening up a spot for her to come out. And think about that. So, that's true too. Honestly, I feel like unless unless she knows in, something, I don't know. That's true. She could know something too. Unless I, th I think if everybody were to tag team up against Aaron, that's the only way. But I don't want. So now now I'm kind of I'm more divided in my thoughts right now because I'm glad Aaron's alive, which was weird, but I'm glad he's alive. I'm glad he won, so that there's not the uh, euthanasia plan. But I don't want him to destroy the rest of the world. That's a lot of lives he's got to yeah. take care of or take out. Levi, he's alive, right? I think so. Because they, they haven't I think, seen him dead. I think uh, what's her name? Hanji. Hager? Hanji. I think she healed him or is trying to inject some Titan fluid so he can. Yeah. So mm -hmm. I think he could probably. If he was able to heal up enough, maybe. 
But then again, I don't know what kind of abilities he's unlocked with the Founding Titan. Like, how much more can he do? Yeah. And then again, he wouldn't necessarily even have to fight. He could just call all those Titans back to, to hurt whoever's attacking him. That's yeah, true. Oh, yeah. He's just so, so powerful. That is really powerful. And it almost makes me feel like Ymir was hiding her true abilities. When yeah. she was like, she was just kind of just doing what was told. Did, did, when that scene happened, did they break out of that realm fully? I only say that because we do see parts of like everybody when he's talking to them, mm -hmm. kind of in that bubble. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if Aaron's still in there and he's outside. That's a good question. And if Zeke's is still in there too. So if and if so, is there still a chance that Zeke can reverse what Aaron did? I'm just thinking of going back to what his the dad said. You know, please stop Aaron. Mm -hmm. Maybe he's gonna be like, I'm gonna I'm gonna do whatever thing I can. And you know what? Here's another thing. Aaron's been playing everyone. He, he deceived yep. Mikasa, Armin, and all their friends. He deceived Zeke to an extent, because Zeke kind of kind of was playing, playing the yeah, long yeah, game, they're too. They were playing dirty, yeah. Maybe he's tricking Ymir. Maybe this was the only way he was going to be able to get control over the Titans. He had to make Ymir believe that he's the one. And if she's able to, if she had all the Titan abilities and was able to see the future, he's got to think, like, this is what I'm going to do. And so right when he came back, Everything was ordered he to go, does, and then he will stop it, maybe. He does know how to make everyone do what he wants them to do. Yeah. So He's out there playing chess. He's a master marker. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like, he knows, he knows how to do it. Master manipulator, master marketer. This is getting good. I mean, this is <laughs> why so it's... weird. It is, so, it is yeah. so weird now seeing, like, how now Aaron has all the control, like, for real, for real, it mm -hmm. seems like. Not only can he summon these titans, but he has, like the titan in him like it's yeah. i don't know so we'll, we'll see what happens thank y'all for watching and supporting our channel don't forget to check out our social media accounts don't forget to like subscribe leave a comment down below let us know what you think about this trailer reaction you can follow us on facebook instagram tiktok twitter and rumble you can also follow our friends on youtube as well jay frizzle clammy and Bloxin for gaming rich aladdin for short films orc text wait for sermons and american rock for fitness and fitness merch with that said i'm devin i'm noah and we'll see y'all next time peace, peace. okay so it was, a, it was a parasite thing? That's what it, I was like. That started this whole transition. <laughs> so a parasite? It was a symbiote. It was, uh, it was, it was venom. It was, uh, it was an accident. Okay, let me, let me stop and start real quick. This is like, uh, some Powerpuff stuff.